in 15th century, in the beginning of the 15th century. People came here to make a Juma Namaz. So this Bibi Hanum was a lovely wife of Amir Timur. Uh, Amir Timur had many wives though. <laughs> He's like he loved the lovely one was Bibi Hanum. And Bibi Hanum was from Mongol dynasty. Uh, do you remember I, I told that what three priests did uh, the like kings, shahs, conquer, they got they married to one the best like lady from that region. When uh, Amir Timur conquered part of Mongol's territory. He married to Bibi Hanu and fell in love with her. They unfortunately they didn't have any children, and Bibi Hanu was cared after Mirza Ulubek, and the ruler of Samarkand, lovely grandson of Amir Timur, whose madrasa we saw in Rajasthan's madrasa. So. Uh, Amir Timur were ordered to build this mosque when he began uh, his like uh, conquering India. This was a present to his lovely wife. They built it for seven years. In 1401, they finished, and the mosque started operating. After like Bibi Hanum ad admired Amir Timur, and she was a noble woman. She uh, she ordered to build the same mosque in the opposite side mm. that we can see here, but it mosque was like, destroyed after a first earthquake, oh. unfortunately. And that the, under the dome there is they built a mausoleum for Bibi Hanum because she had not any children. There is only female grief grief there in, in that mausoleum. The mausoleum is situated four meters on the ground. Still, we can see that. Uh, you can see, but there are also tickets, and 